Hey guys, this is Tiamat Ruler back with another Wonder Cup battle, and this time it is against uh, Norfolk Gaming, which is their uh, YouTube channel. I believe they're a subscriber as well as a Twitter follower, and their Twitter is at Norfolk Gaming as well. They will both be in the in the description. So we will go ahead and get on with this battle, see what they have. Um, I'm I'm pretty about excited about some of my Pokemon here. Looks like he has a an Eevee, a Pachirisu, a Halucha, Kangaskhan, um, Gibble, and Ponyta. I'm kind of jealous of that Kangaskhan, to be honest. But uh, we're going to go ahead and send out Letty Buff first, mainly just because it's um, my crappiest Pokemon I have on my team. So... I'm going to go ahead and confirm that, and then we will get started with this battle. Um, I usually start with the crappiest Pokemon on my team, because that Ladybug just has Tackle. So, it's probably going to die pretty quickly, but, you know, that's how I do my Wonder Cup battles, is I usually start with my crappiest Pokemon. So, as Jordan is issuing a challenge, and they send out Kangaskhan, I kind of expected that, to be honest. Um, well, I don't know what I expected, but... I'm just going to go for Tackle. I don't expect this Ladyba to last. Um, and it uses Fake Out. Pretty expected. As it takes out more than half my hit points. This thing's probably going to kill me without me doing any damage to it. To be honest. Bite. Yep, and it kills me. That's perfectly fine. I understand. I'm okay with that. That Ladyba was just kind of to scope out things. Um, do I have anything? I don't remember what moves this mill tank has. I'm gonna try to go into mill tank here. And see what mill tank can do. I'm gonna go ahead and go for body slam. And to see if I can't get that paralysis off. I'm actually faster. That's surprising, to be honest. Tail Whip. Ooh, dropping my defense. Uh, that's kind of scary, to be honest. I'm going to go for Body Slam again. Try to uh, get that paralysis off. Bite. Ah, No bite. Stop it. Oh, wow. Mill Tank is being bulky and eating that up. Unfortunately, this uh, Body Slam is really the only move I have to really take care of something like a Kangaskhan. I don't have any fighting moves, I don't believe, on any of my Pokemon. Um, and are they going to continue battling? Oh, there we go. There we go. I don't know if there was a little issue there or what, but... Oh my goodness, I still didn't... Um, how much does this heal? Okay, I'm going to go ahead and milk drink real quick. Get my health back up to normal. And then I'm going to go ahead and body slam once again. I'm surprised that Mill Tank outspeeds the Kangaskhan, to be honest. Must not be, I guess, yeah, it's probably not jolly, but I'm still surprised that Mill Tank outspeeds the Kangaskhan. Mill Tank doesn't seem like a bulky, or like a, like a bulky, like a speedy Pokemon to me. But... See what he sends out next. We've only taken out one of his Pokemon so far, so this seems like it's probably going to be a pretty long, a pretty long battle. Um, we're going to go ahead and switch out here to Spin or to uh, Sandile. I almost said Spinarak, but I meant Sandile for sure. And get that Intimidate off. 
and it used Nuzzle, which doesn't affect me. And we are going to go ahead and use Sand Tomb. Ah, and of course he withdrew, withdrew Pachirisu. Trish, what could Trish be? Ah, Halucha, so Sand Tomb's not going to affect Halucha. So we don't want to stay in here either. Um, what do I want to go out into... Um, check moves here. I'm expecting a fighting type move, so I'm going to go out into Snubble. Because Snubble is fairy type now. And as always, if you want to participate in a Wonder Cup battle, go ahead and in either the random wonder trades episode or the wonder cut battle episodes um go ahead and leave your friend code your in-game name and some way to contact you preferably twitter if possible um if not then any way that's an easy quick way to get a hold of you okay so that's 70 damage that's 60 damage we're gonna go for headbutt ah oh, they're keeping they're keeping trish around Okay, I see ya, I see ya. Um, uh, well, I didn't mean to actually go for headbutt, but they're going to go for tackle. Get some damage off on me. I'm going to go for headbutt. I know I don't outspeed now. So I'm going to go ahead and go <laughs> into... Tyrant here. And a mix up oh, growl, not a bad move on your part at all. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and dragon dance. Which will up my attack again and up my speed. So hopefully I start out speeding it now. I'm going to Dragon Dance again. Because I'm either expecting it to switch out or try to growl again. I just want to be able to outspeed. At this point. And my Mill Tank does have a Moo Moo Milk on it. I'm not sure how Moo Moo Milk works. I don't know if that allows for the Pokemon to... Um, use it if it drops at a certain hit point since it's kind of a natural thing. Okay, so we're faster now. And they're going to growl again. Oh, no, they're using tackle. So my attack is actually back up to normal, but my speed is pretty amazing here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to keep going for dragon. I'm going to go for one more dragon dance. I want to outspeed everything. I'm going to be dragon dancing this thing like crazy. They're going to growl again. Oh, nope, they're going to tackle again, which is fine with me. That's not going to affect me very much. And then I am going to go for Thunderfang because that seems like the only one that's going to affect Ponyta here. And critical hit. Nice and powerful crit. I don't know if it mattered or not. It is an adamant big jaw, or strong jaw, not big jaw, strong jaw. Um, but, hmm. What do I want to go for on this Pachirisu? Ice Fang or Fire Fang? I'm going to go ahead and go for Ice Fang. Oh, it doesn't kill, and they get the nuzzle off, which is a big play on their part. Um, because now my Dragon Dance really doesn't matter. Um, I was really hoping for that freeze, but we didn't get it. So, you know, things like that happen. Um, 
That was a... Oh my gosh, Endure. That's annoying. And I'm paralyzed, but they wasted their Endure. I don't know if that can work twice in a row. Um, I don't know what they're going to do now. Spark? It's not going to affect me very much because I'm Dragon type. Fire Fang. Now they've seen all my moves. So they know what I have. This, I told you guys though, this Tyrant is going to be a beast. Um, this is going to be an issue for me though, because of this paralysis. I've got to live whatever he has, or this Gibble could really hurt me pretty badly. My team. Because I don't think I really have anything for it other than this Tyrant. I didn't really think of that in the end. I guess I kind of thought Tyrant had ancient power. I don't know why. I Oh, and I avoid. Nice and powerful avoid. Am I going to take this out in one hit? Oh my god, that was nice. Oh my god, that move right there was pretty much game-breaking. If he... I don't know if the Iron Tail would have killed or not. But it would have done some damage to me. It would have been super nice. Um, but the fighting type moves from Halucha are going to be scary. I kind of want to bring out more Pokemon, but at the same time, this Tyrant is amazing. I knew this guy would... We haven't seen... The only one we haven't seen yet is Spinarak, so I'm not that upset about that. The only one we haven't seen yet is Spinarak. So they're going to use Flying Press, which is probably going to affect me quite a lot. Yes, it does. We get the Thunder Fang off, though. Is this going to take it out? Oh, my God. This Tyrant, though. Yes. This Tyrant is power. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I don't know what I'm going to be able to do to this Eevee, though. Um, it is going to outspeed me. I am going to go ahead and try for the Ice Fang. It's going to tackle me. It's not going to do very much, but it did enough. It did 12 damage, and I'm paralyzed. So this Eevee may be able to take out my Tyrant. This Eevee may be able to take out my Tyrant. It tackles, and if it gets a crit especially. Okay, that did 13 damage. I used Ice Fang. How much damage is that going to do? Is that? Oh my god, that takes it out. It's a crit. Did I just win without using the Spinarak at all? I just did. I probably should have sent out that Spinarak at the end, but man, that Tyrant was power. I did not expect that Tyrant to be that amazing. Oh my god. I think he probably would have done better if he would have brought out the Gibble earlier and hadn't uh, kept the Ponyta in and kept trying to do damage with the Ponyta because the Ponyta really wasn't doing anything. Or if he kept trying for Growl. Because I was just going for Dragon Dancing to outspeed. If he would have brought out the Pachirisu maybe earlier and kept that Ponyta wrap. I don't know. But either way, that that move with the Pachirisu was a good move. But the fact that that Iron Tail missed was a big thing for me. That was a big deal because that Gibble would have probably wrecked the rest of my team, I'm guessing. I could be wrong, but that's how I saw it. That Gibble was probably the biggest threat on the team. Um, but we're not going to save the battle video because uh, I just recorded it, so that's fine. But uh, thank you for the battle, Jordan, or Norfolk Gaming. Thank you. Um, if you want to battle again, I may battle you again eventually. Um, it'll just I'll have to see if there's anybody else. But um, that was a great battle. Um, I just got the amazing Tyrant. I don't know what to say there. That Tyrant was fantastic. Um, if it hadn't been for that Tyrant, you probably would have won, to be honest. But... That was a good battle. I really appreciated that battle. And um, yeah, if you like the va ba like the video, like the battle, leave a like. If you're a first time viewer, please subscribe. And this is Tiamat Rulers signing out. Um, thanks for watching and have a great day. Peace. Make sure to check out Norfolk Gaming. Bye.